we are now in the, the Simondium area. You can see it's like the northwestern foothills of, of the Siemensburg. Right now we're climbing up to this block of Cabernet Sauvignon. Um, as you can see it's a difficult, difficult place to grow grapes, but it's all worth it in the end when you look at the quality in the bottle. Two Centuries is really the pinnacle of the Niederberg range that is available. Um, and the idea is we are reflecting two centuries of outstanding winemaking at Niederberg. If you look at this vineyard, you can see it's in perfect balance with nature. What I like about the block, the way it's farmed, is um, you can see everything is not neatly trellised as, as you see them sometimes in pictures of vineyards uh, are supposed to look perfect. Um, you can look around, you can see the vineyard, everything is nicely balanced. It's not over vigorous, it's not under vigorous. Um, the bunches are small. The Cabernet Sauvignon from this block um, has been used in two wines which have won awards. Uh, the first wine is the 2013 Cabernet Sauvignon, which won the RWSC trophy for the best Cabernet in London. And the second award was the Platters Red Wine of the Year, and that was for the 2014 vintage of the same wine. What makes the site excellent for Cabernet Sauvignon is the soils that we are now is all decomposed granites. It's been around for a couple of hundred million years. It's got a high clay content. So for Cabernet being late ripening, there's enough moisture in the soil for the vineyards to keep on going for a long time. What really makes this block special is what you call in French the terroir. It's quite high, it's like 350 meters above sea level. It cools down at night time. And you get enough sunshine during the day that doesn't, doesn't become, like I said, too hot. We still come to this vineyard at least twice a week. There's still no substitute for the human touch. It's early morning. Uh, we started at half past seven with the harvesting. And we'll harvest until midday to harvest the grapes as, as cool as possible and to get it to the cellar in the quickest amount of time. All the, all the grapes will be hand-picked, especially for the ranges like the two centuries. A lot of detail is done in the vineyard. We've been making wine here for 200 years. There's always been the, the thought of doing, trying things new, trying things differently. You see this, these raisiny type of berries? They should be shaken off, but we only have these nice and juicy ripe berries. In this case, we've got the open top, but we're pushing it down. It's very gentle. When we punch down, through the cake, oh, you can see the wine gushing through. Uh, we really are looking for the very best of the best to go into the fermentation. We'll taste each and every barrel in the cellar and only the best barrels will then go into the making of the two centuries Cabernet Sauvignon. We've set ourselves a goal to make Niederberg known for Paul Carbonet again. We're achieving it and I think in the future just we, we're going to get better and better. This block was planted in 2008. Uh, and for Cabernet, it's still young. As it gets older, it gets almost more into balance. I think we're going to make even better ones from this vineyard. Hopefully we don't age two centuries. 